Hello, my name is Sierra and I am coming at you real and raw and unedited. If you see smoke in the corner, it's because I have incense burning right now. It's a frankincense um, because that's the energy that I need because that's the kind of day that I'm having. So um, yeah, I woke up and I was kind of depressed. So I pulled myself out of bed and with the help of Juan, we got our shit together and went grocery shopping like adults do. And I feel so much better. I don't look better. My eyes are really puffy. Cause like, you know, when you like cry all night and all day, like you, you know that feeling. I know that you do. Um, and I know that feeling too, so it's fine. Um, and your eyes get really puffy and like tired the whole entire day, regardless of like no crying that you do in between they just stay puffy that's the kind of day that it's been um but nonetheless i do feel great regardless of how i look so let's just jump into what we got in this grocery haul because it is currently coronavirus season so the shelves were all empty we are lucky that we basically made it out there alive um <laughs> and i have low lighting and nothing else besides this so let's just jump into it this is the first thing that I have, this is just a personal watermelon that we're gonna cut up along with what else? this cantaloupe melon that we got. And then um, just some of Juan's deodorant, the Tom's for men. Yeah, um, preferred. Preferred. These are my favorite and I obviously needed ice cream today. So this is what we're going with. Um, I love this, really recommend this if you haven't tried it. A smacky snack. It, a smacky snack, yes. And then we got some quick oats. We had to get some vegan butter. This has been a staple in our lives. And since we've been out of the fridge, we forgot to get it. So we were really happy to stock up on that. And then we got some pasta. This, pa or sorry, pasta sauce. This pasta sauce, we were very blessed to find. The pasta shelves were absolutely cleared out before um, we could get there. And this was at the cart, like the end cart um, with just extra stuff. So this was the last thing. Really happy to get that. Um, it was really surprising. It's so crazy to like see the stores like this and like the way that people are freaking out. It's just really crazy. Um, and then unfortunately, we did have to wrap some of the bagels that we got, but I decided that I'm going to be reusing this that we're using now, and I'm just going to bring it over and over again every time we get these bagels, and then that'll kind of make up for it, um, you know, reusing that until its lifespan but we had no more bags left and i mean that's something that we really wanted the next thing that we have are mushrooms these i'm really surprised at how many grocery stores don't have like bulk mushrooms that aren't wrapped in plastic um and then okay we had to get these they're really <laughs> cute they're so small we got these because i'm going to reuse them. We actually get like her exact jam. We love her. Bonnie Maminian. She's oh. great. I don't know. Maminian. I don't know. Can you read that? It's like a signature, so I'm not too sure. Bonnie Mammon? Bonnie Mammon? Bonnie Mammon. She Bonnie makes Mammon. great jam. Really recommend. Um, and we buy like the big size of this, so then we're just gonna like re-put it in this and then bring it to work every day and then like have that for our breakfast. Yes. So I will be using, reusing those containers. And then um, Juan wanted to try this and I couldn't resist because it looked really interesting and kind of good, almost like a flan. I feel like that's I think so. definitely like the consistency that I would be thinking of, um, but it's basically like a tofu dessert. And this was the least weird flavor. There was like a coconut and then I don't even remember what the other one was. No, but that was the first one that I saw, I yeah. think, and I was like, that's it. This is the yeah. better one, yeah. So um, we're trying that out, and then, let's see, had to get another one of these small little guys. And then, honey, when I tell you I was shook mm -hmm. when I walked in to that, I wish- You just now turned and looked back at me, and you had the, yeah, your face. I was shocked. I wish that I, I wish we recorded in the store, like how- <laughs> 
crazy this was but I mean you've seen it on the news like empty shelves it's nothing to like record I'm sure you could visualize what empty shelves look like that's what it was but empty bulk yeah. that's what was crazy the quinoa the rice like usually I get rice I'll get this in bulk and there was no rice there wasn't even quinoa that I could substitute with we were very lucky to find this pasta in the back because there was nothing left oh my god it was so crazy so yeah we got brown rice pasta oh, yeah. that was a pickup win and then we have our whole entire produce bag here and we'll just start with the bag of brussels sprouts that we got okay let me show you <laughs> uh, this brussels sprout that juan picked up this is one this is one <laughs> brussel oh my and Here, let me give you another one for, for comparison for yeah and then this. this is a regular brussel <laughs> this is a big brussel and this is your heart is a squishy that is about the size of your heart. So in comparison, it's closer to the size of your heart than it is to an actual Brussels sprout. That's crazy. <laughs> I was shocked when I saw that in there. I was like, oh my God, that's wild. Okay, <laughs> crazy things here happening at the Winco location um, near us. Reporting live. <laughs> Reporting live. Um, had to get asparagus. Yeah. Um, that was the first thing I think we picked up when we walked in, honestly. Yeah, yeah. I think so. And then we did two zucchinis, um, a must, I yeah. feel like, yeah. some staple produce. You gotta add it to the pasta. Um, we have mangoes, and this is a purple plum. Mm -hmm. We decided to spice up our fruit diet. Um, and then I stocked up and we got two firm pressed tofus. This is the brand that we decided to go with because it had the most fiber and protein True. um obviously wrapped in plastic but these are kind of like the choices that you have to make when going grocery shopping um and then we had to get the little bag of avocados um and then we got a baby bok choy for some ramen that we are yeah. going to be making after this video uh and then look at how beautiful this broccoli crown is i love <laughs> i think broccoli is just so pretty and it's really crazy how it it's like one big of like what it is small it's just so crazy like it's one big broccoli and then you zoom in and these small little broccolis look like this one big broccoli it's kind of trippy it's really crazy anyways um carrots that are from the ground and not baby size <laughs> <laughs> but I do baby carrots. These were the only potatoes offered. Really? Um, so we picked them up. Yeah. I really was stressing. I was like, is this the end of the world? Like, should I be worried? But no, I feel like I'm, I'm stocked up for the week. So I should be good because this is just too much. Okay. Then I got baby spinach. Super stoked to pick this up. Um, because rarely I feel like do we ever find spinach not in plastic had to get two things of green onions And we are reaching the end I promise. Okay, and then we got more of those potatoes We usually make those for breakfast and then lemons for some lemon water Garlic for seasoning another purple plum and let's see what are these guys we have two peaches and another mango so that is our whole entire grocery haul that is what we got today i'm telling you honestly this is what you need to do if you are having a rough day a rough time a rough life a rough week a rough year a rough hour whatever it is you just gotta get up like time this is what Juan and I did this morning we timed things out so like it took us a, it took me a long time to get out of bed and shower but like we were like okay at 1 p.m we're gonna make sure that we have like breakfast lunch done okay by 2 30 we're gonna shower by 3 30 we're gonna leave and that way you know you stay on track but you give yourself time to feel through whatever you need to feel through without being so rushed 
Um, and then, I don't know, like doing something that's gonna benefit you. Like if I didn't grocery shop, I would have no food for tomorrow or tonight. So my sad booty would be really, really sad and hungry tonight without doing all of this. So now I am happy, I have ice cream um, and I'm feeling a lot better. So yes, thank you guys for hauling with me and I will see you guys next time, bye. bye.